What's up guys, welcome to another video. Uh, a few of you have been asking about our car, what we have as a demo car. Uh, it's a daily drive, Honda Civic, five door, so a little bit more unusual rather than your three door. It's a 1.6 VTEC. Uh, so yeah, got a little bit of a kick, it's like 1.6, very, very standard. All it's got is a bat box on it. We've got, uh, engine wise, it's just a standard engine. Um, standard standard uh, filter, standard uh, plugs, you name it, everything's standard on this. Uh, we're going to do a few little mods on this, we're going to get some wheels, lowering springs, we're going to go for every every bit of detail on that and um, do some more videos of, of the car as well as stuff what we do here at Image. We're going to start off with something a bit different, so I'm going to take the camera, flip it around, show you around the car, show you what it's all about and go from there. Yeah, so there you have it, the 1.6 VTEC, very dirty as well as you can see. Um, so yeah, very standard, very plain compared to the exterior of the car, which is a little bit lurry. So yeah. Uh, so I'll take you through the car quickly again. Quite standard, obviously, engine-wise. Wheels, very stock wheels. They're going to get changed very soon. It's not even lowered. Um, tail lights have been done. Tailgate got bumped by a previous customer, uh, previous owner, should I say. Back box there at the bottom. Personalised plate. Don't know if you can guess what it says, or what it's supposed to say. So, yeah, very stock on this, but again, very low repaint. Uh, wrap job, camo style. Been on there for a while now. Obviously the branded Sunstrip, without a doubt. So we're going to get the not so little carcher. We're going to get this engine bay cleaned up. Be careful of any electric ECUs. Always be careful of stuff like that. We're going to get this top panel stripped. The rubber seal stripped. Uh, stickers are going to come off. I'm going to do something a little bit. It's been done before, but a little bit different under the hood on that one, under the bonnet. Uh, hood American. Uh, so yeah, under the bonnet we're going to do something a little bit different on that. Uh, we'll, we'll go through the video. You'll see what's happening. If you're asking what's it running, it's running about 115-ish give or take brake horse. Nothing major with that one. Well, that's the first quarter. Um, just to give it a quick dusting. Obviously, it's cleaned out, it's all prepped and stuff. So it's obviously first coat on, quick light coat. Obviously, a bit of face protection as well. Uh, it doesn't smell too good. Obviously, being in here as well, we're not extracting fire or anything like that. Uh, just using as well, um, more surface, quick colour, B and Q. I think it was 9.95 per tin. Um, it's used for radiators. Well, anything really. Obviously, more surface paint give, gives it away really. Um, quick drying as well. So we can get the bonnet down. That's gonna have to dry now for a couple of days. Um, but we're gonna give it another coat in a minute. Let that dry. A couple of coats. Once we finish, once we've got the, the, the depth we want, um, we'll shut it down. Carry on driving it, and um, in a couple of days we'll do we'll do part two. All right. So that's part one of the engine mod. 
kind of engine mod. As you can see, fully painted gloss white. Got right into the detail, quite a few layers on there. So we'll get that bonnet down now. It needs to dry about 24 hours, possibly 48, but then I'm going to work it tomorrow. We'll get the part two done. Some of you may guess what we're doing to it. If not, you'll see how it develops. Morning guys. So it's part two of the Honda Civic. And as you can see, we've already made a little bit of a start. Um, some of you will probably guess straight away now what we're actually doing under the bonnet. Um, obviously masked it up. We've got done the circle, got some other bits to add on to that. So we're gonna get masked up, finish that up as well. Um, while we're on, um, a few have mentioned the Fast and Furious cars, what we've got, they've seen them on the Jesse videos and things like that. Now that's, that is our collection of the Fast and Furious cars we've got. We're like big kids, really. So, so there's some of the big scale models and some of the smaller scale models as well at the bottom. I think they were on offer somewhere. Um, but yeah, like I said, we're like big kids, really. Never grow up, not when it comes to cars, anyway. Also got some hoodies which have been picked up today, some of our branded ones. Nice big logos on them, so yeah, they've been going out quite quickly. Um, so yeah, all good. Right guys, so we're into day three of the engine dress up modification. Um, I've let it dry a little bit more, I've got to put the rubber seals back on yet. Um, rubber seals back on, the wipers as well. So the wipers of the cable tied together so they didn't go anywhere. Um, rubber seal, I'm going to get the rubber seal cleaned up, that's the, um, but as you can see, that stands out. Then wheels as well, some exciting news about the wheels, got some new wheels coming today or tomorrow, so I'm quite excited about that. Um, so yeah, that's the video done for, for that one. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you did, give us a like, drop us a comment as well. Let us know if there's anything else you want to see. Obviously, we're going to do the wheel, the wheel video as well, probably. Get the calipers done as well. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed. See you on the next one. Right guys, we're into day three of the engine dress up mod. Get this bonnet open, we'll have a quick look. Helps if I pop the bonnet first. So what's it running? It's got the spoon engine, just ordered as well, uh, a T66 turbo with NOS and a Motec exhaust system.